Hey guys, what is up? So today we're just going to do a quick little player join message. Um, so all we need really is a couple scripts. We just need a local script and an actual script. Player joined. Um, was. Uh, main, new player join message, I guess. Um, all right, now in the server script, we'll, we're going to type local rs equals game get service replicated storage local message event <coughs> equals instance.new remote event rs message event dot name equals um player join message event player join message event okay uh, now we're going to do game dot players dot player added colon connect function player and we're just going to do message event fire all clients and above here we're actually just going to do tax equals uh, oops, local tax equals and I'll do undercase lowercase whatever <coughs> equals welcome dot dot player dot name to the game exclamation point local color equals color three dot from RGB and I'll make it purple and local font equals enum dot Font dot cartoon. Now these can be whatever you want, obviously. <clears throat> but for the sake of this tutorial, we're just gonna do um welcome player dot name to the game, and color's just gonna be purple, and the font's gonna be cartoon. All right, so we're just gonna put those in the parameters. So now that's done. <clears throat> uh, maybe we're gonna. Mm, So just to be safe, we're gonna repeat wait until the character joins, uh, and then it's going to welcome you to the game. So now we actually need a script inside Star GUI or wherever I guess, um, and this will just be called player joined message. Let's make sure we got it right this time. So this is the local script. <laughs> <clears throat> We're just gonna type local rs equals game get service replicated storage local message event equals rs wait for child. And actually I'm gonna go back to here and copy this because I don't feel like typing it out. Message event. And we're just going to do message event dot on client event colon connect function text color and font. We're just going to do a local starter GUI. Actually, let's just type that up here. A local starter. GUI equals game get service 
Star G Y. <coughs> now underneath here, we're just gonna type star G Y set core chat make system message some well uh Separate, separate it. And now here we're just going to do the text color and font. So we're just going to do text equals text color equals color and font equals font. Now that should actually be it. That should be all we need. Now I'm just going to double check this so it on client event wait for child yes this is right and this is on the server should wait for the character all right now let's test now when we click play it should I don't have where is my my chat um I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna that you uh probably won't have to do this. <clears throat> but I'm just going to do local starter GUI equals game get service star GUI star GUI concept core GUI enabled enum dot uh, core GUI type dot chat true I don't know why my chat is off but the chat is still off Why is me chat off? I don't know why my chat's off. There we go, now my chat's on. So, <clears throat> as you can see, it welcomes me to the game. And for some reason, turns my chat off. For some reason, I'm not actually sure <laughs> why my chat turned off. But, if we go to um, this little test thing and uh, test two players, you'll see that it should welcome both the players right here welcome player one and welcome player two and on players two it'll say welcome player one and welcome player two and anyone that leaves or joins it'll also welcome them to the game <clears throat> so I'll leave these two scripts in the description because they're pretty short but yeah if you liked it then just hit like and subscribe and I'll see you guys later thanks for watching peace out